morning, church family. Good morning to you. How you doing? Are you blessed? Are you healed? Are you free? Are you saved? Woo, my dear brothers and sisters in Christ. I know you're saved out there. Hallelujah. Amen. And I'm so glad to hear it. Amen. Amen. Um, count it all joy. Uh, right. We call you blessed in the name of Jesus. Amen. Um, thanking God for this opportunity to share God's word with God's people. Amen. Thanking our pastor also. Yes, thank you, pastor. For the assignment. That's right. Amen. Amen. We love doing this. We're looking for the one. That's right. As you know. Yes. Uh, and if you say, well, he says that every morning. Yeah, that's because I'm still looking for the one. That's right. Amen. Amen. So listen, and that should be your heart as well. That's right. Amen. So if you're listening right now, you don't know Jesus as your Lord and Savior, you're not saved. That's right. Cut and dry. Yes. Black and white. That's right. Just like that. But there's a way. That's right. You can fix that. Mm -hmm. You can turn that thing around. Get rid of your doubt. Get rid of your unbelief and start believing in your heart. Start believing. Yes. Amen. That Jesus died on the cross for you. That's right. For the forgiveness of your sins. That's and right. that uh, on the third day, God rose him from the dead so that you could have eternal life with him in heaven. That's an eternal Amen. gift, freely given. And he's done it for you. Yeah. And he's done it for everybody on the, the for the whole world. That's right. Amen. That's right. And listen, if you don't, and, and if you want to, listen, if you want to give your heart to Jesus, yes. I'll pray with you right now. And just repeat after me. Amen. Uh, Father God. Father God, I come in the name of Jesus. I come in the name of Jesus. I'm a sinner. I'm a sinner. And I need a Savior. I need a Savior. And I thank you, God. I thank you, God. That you gave Jesus. That you gave Jesus. For me. For me. I believe. I believe. That Jesus died on the cross. That he died on the cross. I believe that he rose from the that dead. That he rose from the dead. And I receive you now. I receive you now. As my Lord and as Savior. As my Lord and Savior. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. For saving me. Thank you for saving me. Amen. Just like that, I'm telling you, you can ask Jesus to be your Lord and Savior. That's right. If you truly said that and you believed it in your heart, then listen, welcome, my yes. brother or my sister. Welcome. Yes, And amen. I'm telling you. And in heaven, they're rejoicing. That's right, they are. Amen. Amen. Uh, if, you, if you have just received Jesus as your Lord and Savior, let somebody know it. That's right. If you're Amen. looking for a church out there, yes. listen, Res Life Church, St. Louis, Michigan. That's right. Awesome church. Awesome. Awesome church. Awesome pastor. Super awesome. Yes. And our, 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 our pastor, Pastor Rick Lopez and his wife, That's Diane, right. and everybody that goes out to that church, I'm telling you, they're going to love on you. That's right. They're going to show you the love of God. That's right. They're going to show you... Uh, what it means to be a child of that's God. That's right. Amen. amen. And you're going to feel the presence of God in that place. That's right. In your so, church. Amen. For a, or your, in your search. search for a church. <laughs> we'll be over. Yes. Amen yeah, yeah. and amen. Amen. It will be. Yes. And I'm telling you, if you receive Jesus as your Lord and Savior, hey, come check us out at that that's church. That's right. Let Pastor Rick and yes. Pastor Diane know. Say, I got, I receive uh, Christ and I'm here. I'm visiting. So come check us out for amen. sure. Listen. Amen. Uh, yes. We're serious when we say that That's your right. for a church will be over. That's because right. you plug in. That's right. And you'll be like, whoo, this is yes. This is where I need to be. Amen. And Amen. Uh, listen, if you're wondering about what the 714 is, what is this 714 right. all about? Listen, you're going to find it in the book, uh, the, the Bible, the B I B L E. That's right. Amen. Amen. Second Chronicles seven fourteen. Yes. And this is a this is a word from the Lord, and yes. it's for each and every one of us every day. Every day, every moment of the day, amen? That's right. Now, this is one of those scriptures where you should get down in your heart. You should write that on the tablets of your heart. Not just memorize it, but know it. Amen? That's right. And uh, this amen. is, in a nutshell, this is what God is saying to his people, that if you do your part, I'll do mine. That's right. All right? Yeah. And uh, it goes like this. God is saying, if my people who are called by my name will humble themselves, pray and seek my face. Yes. And turn from their wicked ways. Then I will hear from heaven. I will forgive their sins and I will heal their land. Amen. Now listen, Amen. we know. Awesome. Uh, just open your eyes and take a look around. We know that our land needs to be healed. That's right. All right? Yes. We know that our sins need to be forgiven. That's and right. only God can do it. Yes. Amen. Amen. So listen, it's, it's just a few simple things that he's asking us to do. Yes. Humble yourself. That's right. Pray, right. seek his face, yeah. and turn Amen. from your wicked ways. That's right. Amen. So easy. That is easy. <laughs> <laughs> so easy. Are you tearing up the Bible with us? I hope so, because oh, we're doing man. it. Yes, tear it up. That's right. That's I love saying that. That's right. This is Amen. Saturday, day 93. And in Amen. your Bible reading is Job chapter 1. So we're just going to read some scriptures, and, and we're just going to expound a little bit. Um, 
Yeah, we'll not do. Bad a little yeah. Bit, but, yeah, we look at the we look at uh, God's servant Job. <laughs> yes. Hey, uh, one day the angels came to present themselves yes. before the Lord, and Satan also came with them. And the Lord said to Satan, "Where have you come from?" Mm -hmm. And Satan answered the Lord, "From roaming throughout the earth, going back and forth on it." And the Lord said to Satan, "Have you considered my servant Job?" There is no one, somebody say no one. No one. There was no one on earth like him. He is blameless and upright, a man who fears God and shuns evil. That's right. Hallelujah. We're talking about a man here. Yes. And we know that we know that there's one sinless man, right? His name was Jesus. Mm -hmm. He was the only one without sin. We look at our God's servant Job here. He wasn't blameless. He was blameless. He was in, oh yeah, he was blameless. But he was and, not without sin. That's right, and upright. But he wasn't without sin. sin. People got right. his pattern was towards righteousness, yes. and he shunned evil. Absolutely. And that's Absolutely. what we should be doing. Amen. That's right. That should be our pattern, right? That should right? be our pattern, just like <laughs> every day. Every day. Amen. And so the enemy was looking for an open door. Always. Yeah, because you remember the enemy is always, he's the accuser, people yes, he of God. He, he's the accuser who resists, obstructs, and hinders whatever is good. And what is, what is what is that? What is that? What's good? Yes. Everything that comes from God. That's, that's right. good. God that's is right. good. Amen. Amen. And he is here to, he comes to hinder it. That's right. The enemy is constantly looking for yes, an open yes. door in our lives, just like he did Job. Right. He was looking for an open door. Couldn't find one. Yep. To come through that open open door. And Job had, you know, Job was, he was upright. Yes, he was. That's right. And so that's how we have to maintain that same attitude as Job. Even though when the enemy comes, and I, I just, this has nothing, this has nothing really to do with Job, but one of the doors, people of God, that he can come through right. is, is being prideful. Right on. Pride, pride, pride. <laughs> oh, we know that pride goes before right. the fall, doesn't it? It's a trap, people of God. Yes, it is. Even to the strong, the righteous, the wise, they oh. can all fall into it many times. Those are the, those are the. That's right. That's one of the traps. That's one of the traps. That he tries to set for us. That's right? right. And we all know what pride is. It's trusting in our own strength, our own righteousness, right our on. own wisdom. Right on. We look at we look at the prideful, and some would say yeah. that uh listen, that they are prideful, but they don't even know it. That's right. All right, that they have pride in their life. That's right. Listen, or or they even deny it. Yeah. All right. Here's here's something uh that uh that I've heard a pastor say, listen, uh there are those who believe they cannot be deceived. That's right. Yeah. Listen, if that's you, you're already deceived. deceived that's right. Ah, We're listen. just talking about open doors. Yeah. And that's what the enemy was trying to do with Job is find an open door. He could not find one. He could not find one. Had to go to God. That's right. Amen. Yes. And it yes. says this in verse 9. He says, does Job fear God for nothing? Satan replied, have you not put a hedge around him and yes. him and his household and everything that he has? Yeah, you bless the work of his hands and the flocks of the herds That's right. are spread throughout the land. That's right. The Lord said to Satan in verse 12, Very well then, everything that he has is in your bars, but on the man himself, do not lay a finger on him. Satan went out from the presence of God. Like that. That's right, yeah. So listen, people, God, he, Satan will always touch on our weaknesses. He'll always try to find yes. that weakness. And, Absolutely. And we have to make sure that those doors are closed. Are closed. That's right. Every last That's one right. of them. I want to say something this right here, Deanna. Mm -hmm. Um that that the same is for us that when he when when Satan said that about uh, the hedge around mm -hmm. Job, know this. Yeah. God has a has a hedge around right. each and every That's one right. of you. That's his Amen. hedge of protection. Listen, when I get up in the morning, I'm and I'm sure my wife does too. Asking for a hedge of protection. Right. When somebody's traveling, I ask yes. for a hedge That's right. of protection all Amen. around them. And you know God, who's doing that? That's our God. That's right. Keeps a hedge. Why? Because the enemy's going to and fro oh. from, from one end That's of the right. earth to the other. That's right. Searching for an open door. That's right. Listen. Right? That's right. He was. And listen, people, God, Job was a man of integrity. He was attacked by the accuser. But he maintained right actions. Yes, he did. And he won victory over the accuser. So let's continue. Yes. We're not going to be perfect. I know that. God Man. knows that. But let's maintain our right actions like Joe. 
Amen. Hallelujah. You want to pray a solid love, Dove? Father, I just thank, thank you, you for Jesus. this morning, Lord God. Lord, God. I thank you for the people that are listening. Thank you. I thank you, Lord God, that, Father God, that they will keep those doors closed. Yes. Whatever it is that the, their weaknesses, Lord God, mm. that they that you show them that they recognize mm. it, that, Father God, they, they'll just keep that door closed from the yes. enemy to coming in and accusing them, attacking them in that area, Lord God. Right. Mm. We thank you for that. God. Yes, we thank we you thank for you victory. For that, yeah, victory, that hedge of protection that all hedge around of protection. us. Yes, God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Listen, keep thank the you. accuser away from yes. us, uh, Father God. Yes. I know that uh, that is that is your heart, That's God, right. to protect yes. your children. Amen. We thank you for it in the name of, of Jesus. Jesus. We call you blessed. blessed. We love you. Yeah, you yeah. have a great day. Remember to keep your nose in the book. Nose in the book. Knees bent to heaven. And your body in the house right. of God. Hallelujah. Yeah, we'll see you tomorrow, tomorrow morning. morning. Peace. Peace. Oh, baby. <laughs> oh.